uh, <clears throat> looks like they tabled Bill LD 1781 again. They'd been informed by the main revenue service that the wording just didn't make any sense. Because when the bill originally was written, let me just put it this way. The old bill was a, a diesel engine and it had a, a diesel manual to do the recovering of the money. The new bill's a gasoline engine, but it still has the diesel manual with it for recovering the money. So it looks like it's not just going to be rubber stamped uh, next Tuesday. It's going to be next Tuesday, March 6th at 1 o'clock here in the uh, State House, room 127. We, it looks like we have another week to gather uh, uh, people together. I think uh, I agree with Mark that we have another whole week to write letters and to call uh, these representatives and senators. I think it was very important to be in the hallways today, uh, handing out, Bruce said we handed out 145, 150 uh, leaflets. And I think that I had many conversations with people. Um, and um, I feel that we just have another week to go. I, would, I called. Uh, practically everyone on this taxation committee last night. I got to talk to one person, the rest of the people, I left messages on their phone. And I think I'll continue to do that next week. And I, I can't get over how great the article in the February issue of The Bollard is, which is called Ship of Fools, Tax Breaks for BIW, World War III for the rest of us. Um, I wanted to say that this bill, LD 1781, is nothing more than theft from the people of Maine uh, to benefit a corporation that's getting richer and richer by primarily by making weapons of mass destruction. And I strongly urge people to contact their senators and their representatives and say no on this, uh, this completely uh, obscene corporate welfare bill. Thanks. Since we have another week, it would be nice if uh, as many people as they could could meet Bruce at the gates of Bath Ironworks, where he's going every day during his hunger strike to talk, uh, leaflet the workers and talk with the workers. If you can possibly make it there, it would, be, uh, it would be very supportive for Bruce and for the cause, I think. Thank you. Oh, 3.30 uh, shift change at Bath Ironworks, uh, shift change. On Washington Street in, in Bath, yes.